All right, everybody out here doing a little fishing today. Happy 4th of July. First thing I'm trying right now, just a bobber and a minnow. I'm trying out this new shoulder harness. I can't use the chest harness anymore because my beard covers it. I got my head mount on. Just going to try out a few things. Right off the bat, I'm just trying to catch some crappie, maybe bass on this on the minnow here. But uh, we're just going to, I got my other poles there. Monica's over here. She'll probably catch more bass than me, or fish in general, usually does. But I know there's some huge bass in here. We've been seeing them jump. And I've caught them. We've been doing a lot of fishing. I just haven't been filming. But I'm going to try to get you a film or get you a video, some fishing video here and then. Maybe one of these days this weekend, I got four days off, might try to get out with the blowgun, get some frogs, so stay tuned for that. So I'll keep you keep you turned on here. We'll see, get you a couple catches on here and then I'll probably go after some bass. All right, well, I got that bobber out there. Haven't been seeing much action, so I'm gonna try the Slimmer Swimmer from Bruiser Baits. This usually does really well for me down here, and there's been a lot of bass jumping, so we'll give that a shot and uh, see what what happens. Here we go, first cast. Well, it started raining so I got in the truck took my cameras down and pretty soon I got back just got back out I was just getting ready to start setting up the cameras and caught this little crappie on that minnow so looks like he swallowed the hook a little bit I'm gonna probably have to keep this one but, oh well at least it's another a catch we're on the board so stay tuned there we go. got another one on nice little bluegill nice little bluegill I switched to a longer shank hook there too, so that one there is no problem. I can get that hook right out and maybe even save that minnow. Let's see here. Yep, got it. Nice bluegill. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Oh, wait, there's another one. Took it down. Another little bluegill. Another little bluegill. Yeah, that longer hook's really working out better. I can get a hold of that one, get it right out of there. That's what I'm looking for. I don't. The ones that swallow it, I, I just keep them and clean them. But I just cut the hooks off, cut the line. But I, all right, I'll get it out of there. I gotta get the pliers. Stay tuned. I just turned my head and looked over here. Monica just caught a big bass. Holy shit! Nice. <laughs> what'd, you, what'd you catch it on? That's the day. Worm. Uh, my wormy worm. Plastic worm? Yep. Yeah. Alright, cool. Take my picture. Yeah, get your picture. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, there's the first bass of the day. I haven't even started fishing for them yet. I still got my bobber out here. So, pretty soon I'm going to go after some bass. There's been some big ones jumping way over there. I think I'm going to go over there and try for a little bit here. 
There we go. Got him. Got him. Oh, another crappie. Nice, another crappie. Perfect. Perfect. Nice hook set. No problems there. Can get him released. There we go. Nice. Stay tuned. Alright, just got another one. Not sure what it is. Another crappie. <laughs> Another crappie. Man, I was busy bass fishing. I think he swallowed it too. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get that out of there without hurting him. Alright, everybody. Oh, I'm done trying to catch the crappie and bluegill. It was fun, but I've been seeing a lot of big bass jumping right over there. So we're going to head on over that way. Got our bruiser bait. And we're going to see if we can catch us some big bass. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to put this GoPro that's not on my head, the one in my hand, on my chest mount here, or whatever the shoulder mount you call it, and see what kind of footage we can get that way. So stay tuned. All right, everybody, I just got over here. Getting ready to take this GoPro off and put it on the chest or my shoulder mount. But finding all these beaver peeled sticks over here. I knew there was a beaver in here. He's not really hurting anything, so I'm not really w so worried about it. He's not really taking out any trees, but it's just kind of cool when you see stuff like this. And then got this trail right here. I think this is where he's going up and getting them little small willows. And then he's bringing them back and peeling them, eating them. No big deal down here. We don't care. I mean, we got a dam over there for a pond that was behind that, that something burrowed through and, and busted that dam. But if, if anything, we wish the beaver would dam that back up, but I don't think they will. They, they never do what you want them to, so. All right, we're gonna get to trying to catch these bass. They're jumping around here all, all over, so. Stay. All right, first cast with the shoulder mount. See how this goes. One just jumped right here. Let's just, let's try to catch one today with on this uh, bruiser bait. There he is, there's one. Oh, he missed it. Yeah, I, something took it, I seen it moving it. I could see it, but I, and I felt it. Well, let's give him another cast here and I'll keep you on. Let's get over there a little bit. Get out there a little deeper. There's one hitting it. Hitting the hell out of it. Just get the hook. Gosh. Must be something small. Couldn't get it. One just hit it. One hit it. I don't know what it is, he hit it. He's running, now he's getting in this moss. I don't, oh, I lost him, damn it. Oh, one just ate it. Yeah, I got him, I got him. I don't know, Ooh, he might be bigger than I thought. Oh, he's a jumper. All right, I hate the, kind of the shoulder mount. Here, I'm gonna turn the, head mount on too. With the shoulder mount, I'm kind of getting my hands in the way, I think. Decent bass. It's not bad. I got both cameras on now, so hopefully I get some footage of it. Decent little bass. Probably two pounds. Somewhere in there. Nice. This is so much fun. I love, I love fishing down here. So, we'll put him back. Thanks, little guy. We'll try to catch a bigger one for there you. There we go. One just hit it. I was just getting ready to pull it up. And one hit it right here by the bank. I think what I'm going to do is move the shoulder mount over to the other side that I don't reel on. Hell yeah. Nice little fish. 
just I was just getting ready to pull that bait out of the water and he hit it right here close to the bank. Nice fight. I mean, just heavy, thick. I mean, got the slimmer swimmer there. But look at how thick these bass are. Nice, nice fish. Good fighters too. Right down there. Man, nice fish. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. Monica just hooked into another one. I was just taking this off. I want to put it on my other, my left shoulder. It's, it's not doing what I want it to do on my right shoulder. It's too flimsy. This might be a nice bass. I don't know. <laughs> I'm over here messing with the camera, trying to switch it shoulders, and she's over here hammering bass. Yeah. It's a decent one. Yeah, not bad. I don't know if I'm recording or not. Is, my, is the light on my camera blinking? No. Oh, yeah, it is. All right. <laughs> so. I gotta get the back. All right. Nice job. Woohoo! Probably another two pounder. We've been catching a lot of them that Try size. Try tie another hook on, and Monica's over here just catching the hell out of them. <laughs> what she's got this time, but a bunch of moss is what she's got, and another bass, but nice little bass. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I don't kiss the fish, <laughs> he's not hooked bad, so that's good. Yeah, oh, he actually, he is. Yeah, he'd be all right. It's not now, nah, that'll come out. Okay, all right. here's what I'm gonna do over here. I'm gonna go big or go home. I just put a big, bigger three out. I had a two out Gamagatsu, and now I'm gonna put a white um, super swimmer. Go big or go home. Let's see what we can get with this one. Stay tuned. Here we go. The big old white super swimmer. Let's let's see what we can do here. I'll be all cast this one halfway across the pond. <laughs> There's a big bass out there and he wants it, he'll hammer that. Yeah, it's not in that cast, stay tuned. All right, everybody. I had a big one on, on the super swimmer, Bru bruiser bait super swimmer. I, I had it, I turned, I thought I turned my camera on, on my head mount, and I think I missed it. I'm not positive yet till I get home. Um, I think I turned it on when I thought I was turning it off. And it, and it, it took my whole leader and everything, it was a big one, so. I'm gonna try to catch you one more. I'm I'm about ready to go, but man, that was a big fish. I'm I'm sure of it. But we're gonna try again. Try a little, a couple baits here, and just see what happens. You know. Oh, we just had a blow up. We got one. Oh, this might be the guy that I was looking for. I don't know. I mean. The other one took my white super swimmer, so I put on a white and blue. I stopped fishing for a little while. He ain't that big. <laughs> he sure as hell felt big. Wow. He felt bigger. I don't care. I'll take him. Ugh, sure was fun. Wow. So I put on this white and blue super swimmer because the last one took my white one. All right. Well, at least we're back on the board. I think we're about done fishing. We just caught a bunch of some bluegills and a few crappie and a couple more smaller bass. And uh, I just talked to my brother. We're going to have a fish fry tomorrow night. So we kept some fish and I'm going to keep fishing. We're not done yet. So stay tuned. Well, my god, I did catch one. One more. Very, very little bass, but we did get another one there towards the end. We'll see if we can catch one more. I'm, I'm about done for the day.
There we go. All right, little bass, put him back. Stay tuned. All right, we're on. We got one, we got another one. Just hammered it right here. I got two cameras going. I don't know which one's working well. <laughs> it ain't another, it's, it's another small one. Well, at least it's another bass. Been a pretty damn good day, I'll tell you. Yeah, we got it out of there. Little bitty bass. But I'll tell you what, I had a lot of fun. We didn't catch the biggest bass today. I, I did have one on, and I don't know if I got that footage till I get home. Um, I'm gonna throw this guy back. We did catch quite a few bluegill and crappie and some nice smaller bass for, for eating. We're gonna have a fish fry tomorrow. And it's just what it's all about. What a beautiful day. Fourth of July. Happy Fourth of July to all you that are watching me. I appreciate every single one of you I do. I've been been trying to get a fishing video out to you. I know it's been hard for me to do. We've done a lot of fishing, but just just fishing, just having fun. That's all we've been doing, you know. So there, there's a lot to be said for that too, you know. I mean you got you gotta live your life, you know. But uh Thank you so much for watching, for all of you that do watch this video. I know it ain't the best, I didn't catch the biggest bass or the biggest anything, but it's just what we're doing. A nice 4th of July day and catching fish. And uh, tomorrow I'll probably be out here trying to catch some frogs. We're gonna have a we're gonna have a cookout tomorrow night. We're gonna have some fish and some frogs and steaks and do her upright. So stay tuned for that if I video any of that, but uh, I, I will definitely video the the frog with the blowgun so thank you for watching like i said I, I really appreciate every one of you till the next video good luck with everything